They were two old ducks, and all they wanted in all of this world was to have one, two, three, four, five little ducks. That's ducklings to you or me. They lived on the water, and by that place they wanted to have lots of little ducklings. And they looked in their nest, and what did they see? Well, count with me. One, two, three, four, five eggs. The first egg was as big as your hand. The second egg was as big as your other hand. The third egg was as small as your thumb. But the fourth egg was as long as your arm. But the fifth egg was a different size and a different shape and a different colour. And they sat down on the first egg and the little duck came out and it said, Quack! Then they sat down on the second egg and it opened up and out came a little duck and it said, Quack! When they sat down on the egg that was as big as your thumb, they sat down and out came the smallest little duckling that you ever did see. But it had a very big voice and it said, Quack! As loud as you like. Then they sat down on the egg that was as long as your arm. And it opened up and out came a little duckling. That was the biggest duckling that you ever did see. But it had a very small voice and it said, Quack! But when they sat down on the last egg, that was a different size and a different shape and a different colour, they sat down on the egg and out came a very strange looking little duck. And it didn't say quack. It said, quick, 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 quick. What are we going to do? What are we going to say, said the two old ducks. We've got a little duckling that says quick and not quack. But they walked on and they came along to where they found there was a farmer's field. And in the farmer's field there was a farmer. And he was digging and digging and digging. And he was hot, hot, hot. And when he stopped and he listened, he heard the first duck say, quack, and the second duck say, quack. But the third duck said, quack, as loud as you like. Duck number four said, quack. But the fifth duck said, quick, 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 quick. And a farmer thought it was a farmer's wife telling him to dig so quick. And he dug and he dug and he was finished as quick as that and ready in time for his dinner all because he'd heard that little duck say quick and not quack. What are we going to do? What are we going to say? said the two old ducks when people find out that we've got a duck that says quick and not quack. Now, as they were going along they met with someone on a bike. He had a pack and a sack at his back it was the postman, and he stopped and he listened and the first duck said, quack, and the second duck said, quack, but the third duck said, quack, as loud as you like. Duck number four said, quack, but the fifth duck said, quick, 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 and the postman thought it was the postmaster telling him to post those letters as quick as he could. And he posted them as quick as that and was in time for his tea and a kiss and a cuddle from his children three. What are we going to do? What are we going to say? said the two old ducks. When people find out that we've got a duck that says quick and not quack. Now that night the snow was coming down and who was there to look after me, to look after you, all dressed up in his jacket blue? It was the policeman. And he stopped the traffic and to say thank you, the first duck said, quack, and the second duck said, quack, but the third duck said, quack, as loud as you like. Duck number four said, quack, but the fifth duck said, quick, 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 quick. Now the policeman didn't roar or snore or shout or scream. He listened and he could hear a dog barking as quick as you like. And he went to where he heard that sound. And it was the old man, old Tom, who lived at the top of the hill, who had slipped on the ice and fallen on his back as quick as that. And his dog, 
old Tom's dog, was barking to make sure someone would come and help. And the policeman picked up old Tom, but the dog looked around and said, Where is that clever oh, little duck oh, oh, that says quick oh, and not quack? And the first duck said, Quack. And the second duck said, Quack. But the third duck said, Quack. Duck number four said, Quack. But the fifth duck said, Quick, 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 quick. You are a clever little duckling that says quick and not quack, said old Tom's dog. And he taught that duck to dance. And he taught that duck to say bark. And soon it was saying quick and bark and bark and quick and quick and bark and bark and quick and quick and bark and quick and bark and bark. And then the duck said quack. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, said the two old ducks. What can we give you? Old Tom's dog, he looked and he said, I would like to have, I want to have. And everyone thought that he was going to say a bone, but he didn't. He said, I would like to have a saucer of milk. And old Tom's dog, he lapped up that milk and he lay down and he fell asleep. And the little duck that had once said quick and not quack, fell asleep with old Tom's dog and it went quack and then quack 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 and it fell quick quick quickly 